You can migrate your users' mailboxes, calendars, and contacts from Google Workspace to Microsoft 365 for Business. This can be done through an automated batch migration in the Exchange Admin Center. Before you start your migration, you must complete several tasks in the Google Admin Console and the Microsoft 365 Admin Center so that data can be moved securely without loss. First, you need to create a subdomain for mail going to Microsoft 365 from Google Mail. You need this because email migration occurs in batches. This allows users who have been migrated to be able to exchange mails with users who have not. Sign into your Google Admin Console, select Add a Domain, add the name of the new subdomain. Use a name that is a subdomain of your primary domain as this may make domain verification easier. Choose User Alias Domain, and then select Add Domain and Start Verification. Select Continue, and follow the instructions to verify domain ownership. Domain verification usually takes just a few minutes, but it can take up to 48 hours. Now, log into the Microsoft 365 Admin Center. Select Show All, Settings, Domains, then Add Domain. Enter the subdomain you previously created. Select Use this domain, then Continue. Next, choose Add DNS Records. Depending on your domain host provider, Microsoft 365 will try to automatically update your DNS records for the domain. Your domain is now set up. Select Done. In your Google Admin Console, select Add a Domain, add the name of the new subdomain. Use a name that is a subdomain of your primary domain, as this makes domain verification much easier. Choose User Alias Domain, and then select Add Domain and Start Verification. Select Continue, and follow the instructions to verify domain ownership. In this step, you create email aliases using the new subdomain for the users you are migrating. In the Microsoft 365 Admin Center, select Show All, then Exchange. In the Exchange Admin Center, select Contacts, then Add a Mail User. On the Setup Basic Information page, enter the information about a user you want to migrate. For the external email address, type an alias using the domain you created in Step 2. For domain, select the primary domain you are using. After filling out the remaining information, select Next. Repeat this process for each user you want to migrate. Next, you need to add a proxy email address to each user for routing mail to their Microsoft 365 routing domain. Select Mailboxes then choose a user. Under Email Addresses, select Manage Email Address Types, then add email address type. Verify SMTP is selected. Enter the user's alias, choose the Microsoft 365 routing domain, select OK, then Save. Repeat the process for any additional users. Finally, you need to make sure your Google Migration Admin has the correct permissions. The best way to do this is to make sure they are assigned the roles of Project Creator and Service Accounts Creator. Now, you are ready to perform the migration.